Google Workspace is a collection of applications created by Google that allows you to do a ton of different things, such as create a text document, make a slideshow, access your Google email or Gmail account, store files online, and more. You can even use Google Workspace to access YouTube, make a list, or to keep track of your events using an online calendar. And the best thing about Google Workspace? It's absolutely free, and everything is stored conveniently online so you can access it anywhere, including on your phone or tablet. Today, we are going to go over the basics of the most popular and useful apps in Google Workspace, as well as show you how to access them. Welcome to Google Workspace. You'll probably recognize some of these apps, but let's take a look at the most popular ones. This is Gmail, Google's email service. If you don't have an email address, it's a great one to get because it is more secure than some other services, and it also has a lot of great, useful features. It also serves as a login for the rest of Google Workspace, so having a Gmail account is a great place to start if you're interested in any of the other apps in the suite. This is YouTube. Most of you have probably heard of it. YouTube is a video streaming service that allows you to upload and watch all kinds of videos, from news clips to tutorials. This is Google Docs. It's similar to Microsoft Word and is a word processing app that allows you to create and view text documents. This is Google Slides. If you've ever used Microsoft PowerPoint, this is really similar. Slides allows you to create slideshows to share at work, with friends, or with family, complete with music, photos, and more. This is Google Maps. You may have used this before on your phone or another app like it. It allows you to find directions to locations and, if it's on your phone, allows your phone to act as a GPS. This is Google Drive. If you've ever heard of the cloud, this is basically that. Drive is a cloud-based storage app that allows you to store documents, photos, music, and just about anything else you could think of. You even get 15 gigabytes of free storage with your Google account. This is Google Photos. It's an app that can automatically store and organize photos on your phone, as well as allows you to print or display those photos. This is Google Calendar. Want a calendar that you can access anywhere that helps you do things such as keep track of family members' schedules? Calendar does that by allowing you to store important dates and more efficiently plan your day. This is Google Sheets. It's similar to Microsoft Excel. Sheets is a spreadsheet app that allows you to track spending, make lists, and more. Last of all, this is Google News. Tired of going to multiple news sites to try to see what's going on in the world? Google News allows you to view and read all of your news sources in one place. So, how do we access all of these apps in Google Workspace? Well, first you need to navigate to an internet browser, such as Google Chrome. Once you're there, go to www.google.com and log into your Google account by clicking sign in in the top right corner. After you've logged in, click the cluster of nine dots that are in the top right corner. This opens up a drop-down menu that contains all of the Google Workspace apps in one handy, easy to find place. Select the one you want to use and you'll be redirected to the appropriate site. Congratulations! Now you have a better understanding of what you can do with Google Workspace, as well as know how to access its apps for work, personal use, or fun. We hope this video was helpful to you and check back soon to see videos that go into more detail about each individual app in Google Workspace. Happy computing!